Good evening, everyone. My name is Heath Haskins, Code Primate, and welcome back to another Lumber Tycoon 2 video. <clears throat> Before we get started, <laughs> huge shout out to. Oh, where did he go? Where did he go? Uh, there we go. Fade. To Epic. Uh, <laughs> Epic Jet Fighter, no, Epic Fighter Jet underscore 12 for allowing us into his awesome server. Um, shout out to you, buddy. Thank you for putting me on the list and allowing me to uh, use your server for a video and to build. So um, I just took the last piece of palm wood over here and linked it out to our one by ones. I've moved a bunch of doors up to the top. I think, um, let's see, we've got one more to do right here. No, I'll just, I'll carry this up. It's fine. Uh, let's see, when I set this down, it needs to be turn, 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 like that. Rotate once. Perfect. So up we go. Um, a lot of you have been here for a long time. Um, for those of you that are just now getting into Lumber Tycoon 2 or you've never played it before, I highly encourage you, jump in, uh, grab an axe right off the bat, and start chopping. Get your lumber life started. Because this is one of the most amazing games in the entire Roblox community. And you can argue it all you want. It's undeniable. It's, it's uncontestable. Lumber Tycoon 2 is one of the best games on the Roblox platform. And I mean, that is absolutely a matter of opinion, but you cannot argue facts that this game has been around for 10 years. Um, it has, it's, is it 10, 10 years now, I think. And it's got tons and tons of people playing it every single day. And one of the main reasons I think people play it is because of the creativity. You have a base, you can build on that base. You can make anything that you want on that base. And I love it. So, oh, here we go. I'm up. Um, here, we'll, we'll just set that right there for the moment. And I need to move this. Let's see. Move. Wait, is that glitched in? Yeah, that's glitched in, I think. We'll see it here in just a second, because i got to lower that door. Um, anyhow, what we're doing tonight is we're just building and talking like normal. Um, let's see, I need to uh, open this door, right? Open door. And then I need to move this door. Oof. B. There we go. So yes, this one is still glitched because it's just below the handle. Uh, so what we're going to need to do is we will build just like this. I place the first one. Oh, come on. Just like that. Open it up. And then I can place a second one just beyond its borders. Oh, hold on, I'm about to fall off here. That's a long ways to walk up there. Um, I hope your Thursday is going awesome and amazing. Oh gosh. Oh. By the way, if you were here for Lumber Tycoon 2, absolutely awesome, cool. Um, check out my channel for this game called Rain. I've been playing um, this uh, PlayStation 3 game absolutely love it huge shout out to Fezzik for showing me how to record switch games uh, by using an Xbox one controller or Xbox one uh, feed through uh, I'm gonna be trying that and I'm gonna see if my daughter wants to do some collaborations with some uh, some switch games which I think would be awesome I'm I'm ready to do some collabs because she's got her own channel now huge shout out to hope um, in fact, here, I, I need to shout her name out one more time because she's my daughter and I love her and she's awesome. So let's go over here do, 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 do. and here we go. YouTube.com, Hope Haskins, there we go. And fade, 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 fade. The mind of hope. She has currently 202 subscribers. Shout out to her channel because she's awesome. If you're new to my channel, hit that like, comment, subscribe button, and then go over there and find Hope Haskins. That's my daughter. She's doing Minecraft. She did some high pixel uh, sky blocks the other day. Awesome. I mean, her her videos are. If you like my videos where they're 
calm, explained walkthroughs and just being yourself, that's what she's doing. Like she's following in daddy's footsteps. I hope that she starts doing her crafting stuff uh, as well as the gameplays, but I got her set up for the gameplays and it's just gonna be a matter of time. She's getting used to it, so. Anyhow, huge shout out to her. Like, comment, subscribe to her channel. How, how do I, there we go. Fade, 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 fade. Back into the game code. Get this bridge done. That's what I plan to do. I mean, I really, I am, I'm looking to finish this bridge because I know you guys are ready for it. Um, but just so you know, once we get out here to the actual like bridge part, it's going to start moving a lot slower than it is now. Mm, if you did not know. All right, we're going to move this. Oh, oh, oh. It's so weird whenever you get to a certain angle and you have to press down to move up the ladder. <laughs> How many doors do I got? I got plenty of doors. I just got to get to them. All right, we're going to take this, move it down, and this is going to be our drop plate. I'm going to rotate turn. Whoa, 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 whoa. There we go. Drop plates are something that you jump down to. Oh, by the way, uh, that is just a name that I gave them. I don't know if there's an actual name that you... The scaffolding? Just call it scaffolding. It's fine. Uh, rotate turn again, rotate turn again, and we should be back to normal. Yes. Good. Alright, the first one goes at the same height as this door. Open it up. Second one goes at the height of the next door. Can I reach any of that? Yeah, I can reach that one right there. Um... Lots of people think that just because I have a YouTube channel and 100,000 subscribers and wrote a book and stuff like that, they think that I'm made of money or I'm, I've got a bunch of money saved up. I don't, okay? I am, I am just a dad trying to make it through life, having fun, playing video games and, and working. I work full time. Uh, I'm an application development Specialist. I don't want to say specialist. I'm an analyst. And one of the things about my job is to um, take and figure out things. Like figure out people's jobs. What do they do? What can I do to make it simpler, easier, faster, better? Um, do we need to print out all this different paperwork? Would it be better to conserve some of the papers and go paperless or store it into a database or a file of some kind? And I do all that internally. So every once in a while, I will get a call from somebody on the outside, uh, a customer or something like that, and they expect help from us because, I mean, it's, it's our products that we're using stuff like that. Like if they're having problems getting to one of our websites or if they're problem, having problems getting to one of the external websites, I don't deny them help. I don't treat them like they're idiots or that they're, it's below my pay grade to help somebody through an issue. Now, the programmer in me says, no, you don't fix problems. But the human in me, the humanity part, says, yeah, this person has an issue. They need help. Um, one of my biggest pet peeves is when somebody says, well, I'm computer illiterate. I just don't know these things. It is 2020. You know, even if it were 2019. That is, n that is not an excuse anymore. That is that is so far beyond an excuse. It is, if you don't know how to operate basic things like a computer or the internet or Google searches, stuff like that, then you need to reevaluate what position or what job you're wanting to take on, especially when your job needs it. Like it requires you to use Word or email or some kind of... Excel document You should at least have a basic understanding a knowledge of how a computer works 
anyhow, sorry, that's my rant for the day. I'm, I'm not going to rant on and on about things. Um, I just wanted to point that out. I, I said that in a tweet, by the way. And the tweet got a lot of, a lot of traction. Well, not like a bunch of traction, but it's, it's true. Like in today's society, in today's age, if you're trying to do something, it's probably going to be on a computer or something digital, a phone, um, a, and don't get me wrong. My wife wishes that she could go back to a flip phone because they're simpler. They're easier. They're, they're just, that's the way they were. Um, I got her her first smartphone last year. So this is this is the first full year that she's been on a smartphone. And you know what? She's got Google searches. She's been using internet from her phone. She loves it. And I don't think she'd ever go back. She still hates technology. Which is weird. She's married to me. And uh, I love her for it. I really do. I ask her, when was the last time you ran your Windows updates? And she just goes, no, you do that. That's that's your job. <laughs> I'm like, that's not, what? No, that's not an excuse. <laughs> okay, okay. Uh, I, I bet there's a lot of people out there that can feel me on that one. Uh, kids, how many ha times have you had to help your parents with it? Uh, parents, how many times has your spouse said that to you? man or or woman like it doesn't matter because if if a female is really good with computers and the male is is not it's it's like it's expected that you're going to fix the issue with the computer or with the problem i don't know if that's universal or what but it happens same thing with uh parents and grandparents and uh it just happens what I really love is when uh, when the grandparents are very savvy about technology. That's that's adorable. I like it, especially when they when you can hold a conversation with a grandparent because they understand tech. Oh, that's the best feeling in the world. And it doesn't have to be new tech. I mean, it could be old school tech like AS four hundreds and and green screens and terminals and stuff like that. I still like those conversations. Doesn't make me a boomer. And it doesn't make them a boomer. By the way, uh, I guess the word boomer made its way to Congress as a uh, discrimination case. Supreme Court or something like that. I don't know the exact details. I just saw that it was one of those articles on Twitter. So... Um, also, I was thinking about creating a uh, Reddit page for like Reddit questions and stuff like that. Like um, last week, you asked code or something. I don't know. Do you, do you guys want something like that? Tell me. Tell me in the comments down below. Communicate with me. Would it be easier to just do a Q&A here in the channel and then I'll answer as many as I can? You know what? Let's do that. Ask me questions down below. Ask me questions down below. Ask me questions down below. Hold on. How do I ask ask me questions down below? Mquideb. Mquibdib. Ask me questions down below. Ask me questions down below. Huh. I might have an idea for a new series of some kind. Ask me questions down below. So do it. If you have a question for me, or if you have uh, any kind of question that you've ever wanted to ask, comment of some kind, put it down below, and I will try and get to it uh, before I record the next video. Um, no guarantees that it'll be in the video. It could be really long. I don't know. Just make it blow up, and and I'll I'll go down there and, and see what kind of questions we got. Uh, please make sure that they are appropriate questions. I don't want to be asking, like, how many times do you poop during a day? And because I just said that, somebody's going to put that in, aren't they? Oh, gosh. Now I'm going to have to answer it. <laughs> the answer is five. Five times a day I poop. But that's okay. <laughs> so, 
<laughs> Somebody watching this video right now goes, Oh, dear Lord, he, he poops five times a day? <laughs> That's horrible. <laughs> uh, I'm just kidding. I'm kidding. But seriously, uh, the, the Rain series, you need, you need to go watch it. Okay, I am... I'm a hopeless romantic for, for stories like that. And... I think that's why I like Shadow of the Colossus so much, and ICO, and Rain. There's just that story of boy meets girl, boy rescues girl, boy gets chased by extraterrestrial being. I don't know. Maybe that last one didn't fit in, but I like those kind of stories. By the way, Today is the 15th that I'm recording, so today is the 16th. It's the first day at PAX, and I'm not there. I, I can't go. I've got the media pass, I had the plans, and we had a car breakdown, so I can't leave because if I did, I'd be leaving the family without a car, and I can't do that. I can, cannot do that, so I, I apologize. Family first. Um, but, you know what? It's it's no big deal. There's plenty of conventions and stuff in the future that I'm going to be going to. Or at least signing up to try and get to. And we're, we're not going to look at this as a bad thing. We're going to look at this as, hey, I get to spend time with my family. I get to spend time here and hanging out. Making more videos for you guys. Uh-oh. That one not have enough. 92%. Uh-oh. Hey, get back over here. You stay right there at 92%. We're going to chop a little one. Just a small one, a smidge off the end here. There we go. Fill that one in. Good. No. We're just going to chop a little bit bigger than the, the one unit. That way we can make sure that these get done. And I'm just going to speed through these. Um, by the way, I found out why... My wife doesn't like watching some of my videos. And it's because I'm in first person jumping around like this. And she goes, you record like your mind works. It's just da 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 All of a sudden it's over here. Hello. Thank you, Thomas Stone, for the subscribe. I appreciate it. If you're not subscribed right now, hit that like, comment, subscribe button down below. And you can pause the video. Come back anytime. We'll be right here. By the way, if you didn't know, I have been doing P90X. Uh, I've been doing great with my diet, and I allowed myself a cheat day on Tuesday because uh, apparently I'm supposed to be taking in more calories than I normally do because I'm working out, and I didn't realize that, and I've been starving, starving. If you happen to be in Springfield area, or if you come down to Springfield, Missouri, I highly recommend you go check out Red's. It's like one of the original drive throughs Their burgers are so amazing. <gasps> I got the the double, which is a double steak burger with pickles, mustard, mayonnaise, um, french fries, uh, onions, and all this other stuff. It's just, it was phenomenal. Anyhow, sorry. I'm like watering at the mouth now. It's so good. Um... This isn't really working out for me. Let's uh, let's pack this truck up, and I'm gonna use it to kind of jump on as long as I don't cover up the board. Pink. Uh oh. And down you go. Yay! <laughs> I got it. Ooh, now. Let's try not to put an entire piece inside the thing this time. Because last time I lost like two humongous one by one logs. Because I ended up putting up. Oh, did you see that? It was like a hockey shot. Boom. Okay, that one wasn't. But the other one was. That was, a, that was an awesome shot. Alright. It's kind of like a little mini game. Fill in blueprints by uh, throwing one by ones at them. That would kind of be a fun oh, idea for a collab. We're going to play uh, hockey across the... Whoa, it's, it was a spinner. 
put up little obstacles on the on the course. Dude, this is awesome. <laughs> oh, I'm having I'm having so much fun. Good. Good deal. Um the one main thing I would love for you to take away from my channel and from me is genuine personality. I don't want you to think that this is a persona that I put on just so I can come and record. I don't want you to think that like I'm any different in person than I am on video. Um, the only difference might be a little bit of my language and you're gonna get a hug. Probably, probably gonna hug you. So, watch out. If you come up to me in, in the mall and you're like, oh my God, you're code primate, and you're getting a hug. Yeah, that you've embarrassed me and now it's my turn and I'm going to embarrass you. Of course, I'm I'm talking to the the grandparents. Of course, you know. <laughs> oh man. <laughs> that one went a lot faster. Was was that not as big as I thought it was? Huh. We need more. We're at 21 minutes. Code. Jeez. I know we are we are flying through these episodes, aren't we? But it's a good thing. It's good. I don't even know if are we are we up to here. Let's go ahead and reload. Hold on, do I have any doors down? I do not. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and load her up again and just see where these doors are. Reload the slots. Yes, glorious. Glorious of the day. <laughs> I'm, I'm excited. Um, by the way, do you have any uh, ideas for series of PlayStation 3 games or Switch games that I could play for you? Um, I do not have a PlayStation 4 Pro. So you got to pick something with the PlayStation 3. Um, or I have a Wii. I have a Wii U. Something like that. Uh, my wife suggested that I go and play... Outer bounds, out outbounds. Hold on, it's a it's an epic game, and I could absolutely go play that. But at the same time, I'm like, it's kind of a more adult game. Has a little bit of cussing, a little bit of violence. Should I? I mean, I absolutely could. I'm I'm not um, made for kids, you know. It's not like I'm going to jump on here and start playing some Watch Dogs. Which, by the way, kids, it's not family friendly. For anybody that's ever played Watch Dogs, more power to you. That, that is a fun game. There's also Watch Dogs 2 and I think a Watch Dogs 3. Okay, Google. Is there a Watch Dogs 3? Oh, cool. The game will be out be a PS5 or an Xbox Scarlet launch in 2020 and beyond. Cool. I did not know that. And now I know. And knowing's have to power. D the ba battle. Battle. Knowing's have to battle. G.I. Joe. <clears throat> oh, I was going to open this up. And we are going to drive and go see how far this goes. I think what I'll do is I'll make this go to the end right here because right let's see right here we're actually going to have to split out and do the bridge part so it's going to become bridge bridge like so, um, what I can do, I can stand here at the end, and we can put our mouse, hold on, put our mouse right here. This is, this is where the door needs to go to, and if I do one, two, three, four, right there is where 
the door is. So we need one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. We're going to need eleven more doors to complete this task for the day, and I'm gonna go do that now. We got five minutes left for a 30 minute episode. Let's get, what did I say, 11? 11 doors. We're going to do 11 doors now. Is there any other doors up there, maybe? I don't know. I don't know. There shouldn't be. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Gotta get this on the property. There we go. That way, it'll save. Let's pull upward, good. So, 11 doors. And I think I've already got 11 doors here. Let's make this stay right there. Stay, stay, stay. Whoop. So, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. Right here. I think. Is that right? 2, 4, 6, 8, 10. No, hold on. I grabbed wrong. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. 11 right there so um hmm. which one are we landing on okay it's gonna be it's gonna be this this white one right here so there's one who that's a slow movement okay move and two and And four, five, six. Uh oh, did not. Okay, there we go. Seven. Eight. Whoa. Why did that happen right there? Hey. Hey, you. That's not where I told you to go. I'm not going to be able to grab that from there. Oh. Okay. Get up. Up, 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 out. Thank you. And. Right there. Three more. Three more doors. Did that take more than five minutes? Ooh, 27. We're at 27. We are going to attach these, and then I'm going to jump down, and I'm going to show you. This was the perfect measurement. There we go. Sweet. Up, 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 up. By the way, the trip up and the trip down is going to be less and less, because taking the trip all the way to the very top just takes forever. Forever. I was thinking about doing a chair bridge on the, uh, or a chair ladder on the back of these, but I need to go get the, the chair blueprint on this space. I don't even think I have all the, all the blueprints. Maybe I'll do that for the next episode. What do you think? Maybe? No? I right. I don't know. Coffee time. Hmm. <clears throat> I was just looking at my lighting. I'm like, wait, did did those turn on me? Do I do I look pasty pale? Well, I look pasty pale anyway. Oh, am I going to be able to grab that? I can't grab that. Oh gosh. Okay, jump out, grab, move, we. Nope. These all landed weird, didn't they? Weirdness. Am I going to be able to grab those? I don't know if I'm going to be able to grab all that. Okay, let's place this one here for now. I need to jump right here. This is the perfect spot. Open. Move. B. There we go. So now I need to place. Open. And we're going to grab one more. Right here. Move. So that's one, that's two. Come on. Move 
B. Move B. Open. And move B. There we go. That was two. Oh, wait. Do I need this to... There we go. I need that one closed so I can place the bottom of this right there. And then I can open it and place two. And two, or three, three, three. Four, close, close, open, nope, come here, open, open, what, move, B, open the door, move, B, there we go, okay, cool, now we can close the door, A lot of you might be wondering, like, why are you doing this code? Well, because I want the ability to drive my truck out to palm woods to collect palm wood a lot faster. Yeah, but you're using all this palm wood to make the palm wood bridge. I know, it's ironic, isn't it? So. <laughs> Come on. Place, good. And I'll just go ahead and take this one with me. Wink. Come on, I can't reach it from there, can I? There we go. Oh, uh, I need to not move that one yet. We'll move this one. And now I can open. This one I can close, this one I can close, and we're going to move this one. That'll be good. Um, oh, I've got one up here. Yay. Thank you for not being placed where you were supposed to be. I appreciate it. Rebel doors. That's, that's what these things are. Doing what they're not supposed to be doing. They're rebelling. Can I reach that? Can I reach it? Please let me just... Okay, that's... That's annoying. Can I reach this? Yes. Okay. Down, 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 down. I'm going to need to go rotate turn. And... Oof. By the way, the oof sound apparently is in trouble. Tommy is claiming that he's got it. Oh, okay, you know what? We'll just do this. That's easier. Then I can grab what I need. I can grab them and be done. But now I need to rotate this back, don't I? Um, okay, so turn, turn, turn. And rotate. Good. So this goes up here. Move this one. It goes right here. And down we go. We can go. Oh, close. Close. Move B. Move B. Is that the right height? Oh, gosh. Yeah, it's the, it's it's good. It's good. We're good. Thirty four minutes. Thirty four minutes and counting. That's okay. If you have something to do, if you've got school or if you've got work or if you need to go somewhere, go do that first. Uh, my video will be here when you get back. Plenty of time. Plenty of time. Don't worry about it. Okay. You can come back. Hit the pause button if you need it. We'll be right here when you get back. Sorry, I don't know if that's a, a copyright from Tony Horton. Uh, can I? <gasps> no! <laughs> uh, 
Okay, it works, kinda. <laughs> I just left it the way it was because I didn't want to have to rotate it again. <laughs> okay. Whew. Fun times. Fun, fun. No, no, no. I just, I just wanted to close it. Please. Thank you. Open. Move this one. Move, move this one. Move this one. And it goes right here. Maybe. Move. This one goes right here. And this one. Oops. Need to open this door first. Now, this one can go right here. Maybe. Good. These should be all attached. Move B. Close. Move B. And the last one's already closed, so move B. And we should be at the ocean. Open. Jump into my car. <clears throat> Jump out of my dreams. Get into my life. <clears throat> Sorry. Uh oh. What happened? Did we leave some doors up there? Oh, we left doors. There's doors left at the top. Okay. Um, hold on. I don't want to reload yet. I want to get the truck back over there, and then we will we will close the doors. Reload and hopefully the priorities will be straight. Oh, goodness. Alright, stop, jump out, and menu. Load. This one right here. Reload? Yeah, I want to reload. Reload it! <clears throat> am I recording? I am recording. Okay, cool. We're almost to 40 minutes, but that's fine. It's a Thursday, you know, just hanging out, chilling. Chill in. Ask me questions down below. I, I like the ring of that. Ask me questions down below. It's not Loai like PewDiePie. Last week I asked you. And it's not meme time, meme time. Everybody knows who I'm talking about. So, I don't know. Is that is that copyright? Can I get a copyright strike for singing another YouTuber's song? I don't know. I was only making reference. I'm not trying to sing his song. Oh no! Did that? Why is this down? This should be up. I thought it was up. <gasps> no. Oh, it'll be fine. It's fine. It's good. Alright, once I see my axes appear, I should be able to uh, move that bottom door. <laughs> that bottom drawer? No, bottom door. Move. B. Out. Alright, let's take a look. Doesn't look like we left any up there. Which is good. That's a good thing. Let's back off these presents. Oh, goodness. Did I take any turkeys with me? Nope. We may have reached the ocean. It's time for Hoover's ride. There we are. Cool. Cool, cool. Um, I'm actually going to need to start back here. I think. I will. I will need to start back here because this has got to come out. Actually, I'll, I'll need to start from down here because this is going to be a door, this is going to be a door, and then we need to split out. This is going to be a door, this is going to be a door. So it's going to be four doors wide um, with three lines of door hinges. Does that make sense? It does. 
Hmm. I wonder if I could get. No, no, no. It's fine. It's fine. Uh, let's, let's take a screenshot right here. Finally made it to the ocean. To the ocean. Yay. Thank you, everyone, for watching this episode of Lumber Tycoon 2 with me, Heath Haskins, co prime Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe down below. Do all those cool things I'm supposed to call out at the end of the videos. Like a good YouTuber, but it's your choice. It is your choice. It is your freedom. It is your right to not have to do anything that I say. And if you wanted to, go for it. If not, fine. You were here, you listened, you watched, and that's what matters to me. Love you guys very much. Have a great night. Uh, and actually, that's not true either, because I'm not really too concerned about the views, okay? It's more of, even if a thousand people watch, and one person is affected by something that I said that day, that's what I went for. That's what I'm hoping for. Love you guys very much. Have a great night. We'll talk to you very soon. <gasps> Outro.